Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we've got such an exciting video. I'll try and show you. Look at all these goodies. So I've got a whole box, a whole shoe box <laughs> full of items that I got from Timo. So today we've got a Timo haul. So stay tuned because we've got a bunch and bunch of nail art and you all know I love nail art. So let's get right into it. So first things first, I got these purple crystals. Maybe if I open them, you'll be able to oh, see the colors a little bit better. But I don't have a pastel purple at all, or any purple for that matter. So they had literally two packs together. You could pick one that was one color and then the other one that was a different color. But I did end up just picking up the two because I just have no purple. So we picked up these. Of course, you get different sizes in each little pot, which is fun. So they came in a pack of two. You do also get this little tweezery thing. One of these. And... You also get one of these little pencils, which I think are supposed to help you pick up the... Oh my god, it works! Ah, it works! Okay, cool. So, that's basically the first item. Everything that I got today was immensely cheap, so I'll make sure to leave prices on the screen as I'm speaking. And as many links as I can in the description, because I know they sell out so quickly on the website, so... Yeah, if I can get the links, I'll try and make sure to include them. If not, they'll have similar things or just keep an eye out because they keep adding new things. And in case everyone's, anyone's wondering, I've got my nail star for once. And the colour I've got on today is from McCart. It's one of their like super neon colours. Let me show you one sec. Okay, so it's this stunning colour. Look how beautiful. I literally was digging for the most neon shade I have in my collection and this one was it so this is the color of my nails in case you're wondering and i'll have a link to my card in the description if you want to save yourself some money because they're absolutely amazing colors on their website moving on i got some caviar beads so they had this little pack different sizes of caviar beads so i thought i'll pick it up just so you know everything does come kind of packaged in little foils or little like baggies but i take them out before i show you because i feel like the light kind of reflects on the item and you can't see anything so then we have these cover beads, which is fun that they come in these containers because they usually are reusable, so you can pop some other things in there once you're done, which I often do, so that's fun. All right, so next up, I've got these jelly-looking crystal -y charms. As you can see, they're all different. We've got a skull, we've got a bow, a heart, a little diamond, all sorts of different little shapes in there. I thought I might pop it into a little container to show you a little bit better what they look like, but they look so cool. I'm so excited that skull is amazing for Halloween. It's so fun because I think it's about 50 to 100 little pieces and it was probably a pound or something ridiculous like that. And you get such a wide variety. I definitely see myself picking these up very often. They're really cool looking. Looks like each one has like a different color and as the light reflects on it, you can like see that this one's a bit more greeny teal and like you get the blues and the purples. It's honestly stunning. These are so cool. Next up, we got a bag full of black slash purpley blue bow so you all know i love my bows that's for sure i feel like i do try and include a bow every so often into my crystal placements and these were very very interesting i have to admit these are literally so cool so they're black but they've got this purpley blue glittery reflection in them so as the kind of light hits it kind of gives a different color i don't know if the camera's really picking it up but they're stunning and there was like 100 to 50 in the bag once again super cheap i can't remember the prices but i know everything that was put into my basket i was amazed like this is way cheaper than sheen this is crazy craziness i don't know how they're making money but yeah these are literally so cool looking gonna be perfect for the october september kind of halloweeny dark color colored nail sets that'll be really fun to do Next up, I got a bunch of nano tape. I think there's about five meters in these. So I use nano tape to hold, once I'm done with my like four or five set of nails that I film, I just put onto a nano tape and I just put it into a little like box I have that I store all of my little tips. One day, um, once I move to my new house and everything happens, which should be in the next couple of months, I'll do a whole tour. There'll be way more vlogs and me showing you guys around. But at the moment, I'm in a little flat and there's not really much to show you. It all looks like a mess. So just bear with me. Soon you get to see the whole collection, how everything's, you know, looking. And I'll kind of take you on the journey of me moving into my new nail studio and everything like that. But 
for now i can just kind of you can imagine what i'm talking about <laughs> so here we've got nano tape i use it for you know you can use it for press on nails but i also use it of course for storing my anything really either <laughs> press on nails or when i do my nails for youtube and i store them nicely in a box otherwise they'll be all messy and i wouldn't be able to like match them together in a set that makes sense next up i've got this humongous container full of I'd call these kind of jelly crystals. They're not like proper crystals. You almost got a mixture because these are like see-through. And then these are like a bit more solid color. But they're still giving this jelly. Like this one is stunning. This is so cute. Look at that. I don't really know how you would call these crystals specifically. Because they're like not crystal crystals. But they're, they're just stunning. And not only do you get this whole container. But you also get the crystals inside. And it was something like one pound something, two pound if, if I remember correctly. It was ridiculously cheap. And I was shocked because I know that Shein definitely sell this. I think it's way cheaper on Timu, I want to say. And I know that um, Shein sold something similar that I picked up, but different kind of crystals. And yeah, I was just really surprised to see that also on Timu. I'm really happy with this. You get the container. So once you use up your little crystal gems, you can reuse this as well. Or sometimes what I like to do when crystals are quite similar, like these two are literally identical. So I'd probably just pop these into there and just reuse that for something like maybe the bows or something <laughs> just because i'm running out of storage so anything will literally help just to you know condense it and get a bit more space next up i place an order for some glitters at this point i need to buy more containers because my whole drawer is full and i need more containers because i'm starting to just you know hold these bags but when they're in bags i don't use them because they're not in my drawer so i need to definitely invest in some more baggies not baggies, little containers. <laughs> um, but I got some glitters that I don't have in my collection. So this one is silver. It's almost kind of matte looking. It's so cool. I don't have any kind of silvery looking ones like this. And it's a nice mix. You get the large hex, medium and fine in there. It's really, really, really pretty. And look how big this bag is. It's like 50 grams, I believe. It might even say on here, actually. No. Oh, yeah, there we go. About 50 grams. <laughs> about 50 grams so yeah big baggy so from the same seller i picked up some matte white glitter as well i thought this would be so amazing for winter for like you know wintery snowflakey nails i thought this would be really cool and anything else for that matter really like i feel like white just works with everything so picked up some white and also another 50 gram of black which is kind of given matte i think it is matte but it's still got that reflection so cool and there's so much in there like what stunning huge amazing and then from a different seller as you can see already we've got a smaller bag which is absolutely fine because once again i will never end up going through all of this probably unless i do some crafts <laughs> so we've got some pinky in there very really really pretty and considering how big my glitter collection is this is still a color i don't have which is so fun to see on that they're actually selling colors that i don't have so there we go it's a very very pretty pink oh my gosh very pretty 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 and then we've got a similar one just a different color giving a bit more purpley shade but it's that in between where it's like purple but you could also kind of class it as a pink i hope that's the i hope the camera's picking it up because it's definitely a, not a solid purple it's that kind of in between a purpley slash a neony barbary pinky shade if that makes sense um but yeah these are them next to each other absolutely stunning Next up, I thought I will show you all of these together because they're kind of on the same vibe. So if we start with the actual butterflies, all from the same kind of category. So I love when um, acrylic nail techs do the whole vibe where they apply these kind of little butterflies and then they matte top coat it at the top or, you know, a capsulate matte top coat it and it looks stunning. I love how it looks cloudy on top of it. I love that kind of look. So I thought... Um, I recently, you know, picked up more acrylic. I'm getting into poly gel a little bit and all of that building stuff. So I thought, let me pick up these and maybe challenge myself to a little set or something like that. So I picked up every color they had. These were like 20p, guys. 20 or 40p. Can you believe that? Look how many's in there. There's loads. So we've got a green. We've got a neon yellow. Stunning. We've got two oranges. One's a bit more paler than the other. This one's almost like a bit more fiery, as you can see when you compare the two. We've got two pinks. One is, once again, more fiery than the other. There we go. Those two next to each other. Like, this one's given a bit more purpley vibe compared to this pink. Then we've got one blue. We've got one purple. Here they are next to each other. This together as a combination would look so beautiful. 
and then they also had these stunning little things so they had a mix of pink and gold of butterflies so i thought i'll pick that one up and they also had a mix of gold and pink hearts but as you can see they actually got different size hearts so you've got small ones and larger ones in there i think this is so cool i cannot wait to try the whole encapsulating matte top coating thing i hope you guys like that kind of stuff because honestly i love it every time i see it on an elsa i am obsessed and i just want to look at it and everything like that next i picked up this pink crystal selection <laughs> i hope that the reflection is not in the way but they're literally a dusty pink i don't think the camera is giving it justice but they're stunning and i am so happy with it the different crystals in there you got some flowers you got a very nice selection of different like shapes but they also give you just the normal circle ones which is so fun because you can literally make a full-on crystal placement with just what you've got in here which is amazing i wonder if it actually tells you no we just know that's pink so that's cool but yeah they're so fun i think they had other colors too okay next up let's talk about these beautiful little plates oh my goodness imagine a nail set on these so when i saw this on their website i was absolutely amazed look how stunning this is so i thought you know place your nails on here if you want to take any cool pictures or anything like that or even if you have to place some gel polish on there for like your little plate when you're doing nails stunning like these two i really wanted this one this one was out of stock so instead i got this one but then after buying this one, I looked online again and then this one was back in stock. So of course I had to get it as well. They were a bit more price pricier compared to the actual nail art itself, but it makes sense. I mean, look at this. It's very heavy. It's like good quality in my opinion. Really cool little uh, plates that you can get. Next up, let's talk about stickers. This place, Timu, is absolutely filled with stickers. So i don't often pick up stickers when it comes to like my actual nail design when i do on youtube or instagram or tiktok or anything for that matter but i'm getting more into building and doing nails and even my own as you can see so i thought you know for halloween it will be really cool to get some stickers especially as i am doing a bit more people's nails as well i've got some clients and stuff so i thought stickers are a really cool thing when you're actually doing clients nails i feel like just a quick um show of stickers and i get really excited and end up picking one i've already had um, a couple of clients that i just took some simple blue butterflies and they were literally obsessed with it so i thought let me pick them up if they don't end up being used over the halloween time we can always do some smaller nails on my like my hand or something for the youtubes or anything like that and we can use these up they are literally stunning so first one up i feel like i'm just talking way too much this is a pink cute one so you got a little bird but you've got pink pumpkins which is really cool little bird there with a skull the little cute ghost like this one is so cute it's cute but scary at the same time like what is that that is scary or even that one oh my god oh yeah here it is <laughs> that one is not cute but everything else is cute so there's that one then you've got these really cool funky skulls which are so fun look at these heads i love how they got little hearts and the little bow on there that's so cool or you can get a little pirate one which is so cute as well and a little oh my god guys the spider with the bow are you kidding me so cool they're literally so fun obviously quite large for the nail as you can see but might work pretty well for my press on nails or for my long stutter ones that I usually do for the channel so we might be able to figure something out with these next up we've got your typical halloween orange you know orange pumpkins and everything like that so you've got a little eye pumpkins of course um just your standard skeletons this one's given just straight halloween now this one is a gory halloween scary very much actually scary so you've got skulls you've got blood roses just on the scary side <laughs> i definitely prefer the other pinky ones and then this one is so cool too more skulls but kind of scary but not it's kind of given a bit of scary but then you, they check on some flowers and it kind of just flips it around so that's fun but then also some scary ones too i just really think they're cute and fancy and i like them a lot i really do so here are the only stickers i got mainly halloween next up i've got three things you could say from like the same seller i guess they had these little selections and they had a bunch of colors so i went for pink blue and just a standard white and as you can see they're literally filled with really fun cool chunky little charms so i thought let's have a look what that's in there most of the stuff that i'm looking at today i just chucked into my little box and i just left it till filming so it's kind of exciting for me to see what exactly came Ooh. oh my god that's so cool look at this 
So you get a bunch of these little hearts, which is really fun for like kawaii nails. I've seen a lot of people do. Oh my god, look at this jelly looking see through bow. Oh my god, that's so cute. What is this? Oh my god, this bow. Ah, come here. Look at that bow. Oh my gosh, that bow is stunning. You get some flowers, which we use quite often. We've got a little rose, different kinds of. Oh my god, this rose. Guys. The rose, the flower. Oh my god, I haven't seen a flower like that before. What is that big thing? Is that a bunny? That's a bunny head. <laughs> That's a bunny head. Interesting. The, the butterfly. This is crazy good. I'm so happy with this. Another bow that I haven't seen before. Like the detail on these charms. Wow. That's so cool. Okay. I am very like over the moon with this. So I can only expect that the other two are the same. So you've got a pink version, you've got a white version, and of course you've got a blue version. And of course they had more colours, so if you are into purple, greens, I don't know, any colour, greens, yellows, whatever, they had all of these different selections. So go take a look, because these are pretty cool. There's probably no way I would have brought a whole bag full of these or these, but in a mix, pretty cool, I have to say. Pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Next up, we've got these tiny little paws, which I thought was so cute like look at these you get a different color selection you've got yellow pinks maybe like a bluey greeny reflection to them they're so cute and tiny like look at that on my nail like so cute so we could do like an animal inspired whole set with these cute little paws they were like 20 piece i could help myself couldn't have helped myself then as you all know i said i like my butterflies so we do have a bit of butterflies to show butterflies and bows so coming up butterflies first is that a bow was that butterfly maybe both <laughs> so here we've got just huge butterflies like humongous butterflies but that would literally work perfect for me doing my stiletto nails that's why i picked them up so you've got a nice little selection you could pick individual colors and have a whole bag of the same colors but once again i kind of you know i want like a selection just because i can have different colors and i don't need like 50 of the same color so we got that then it looks like possible bows I don't know why it came in the little bottom, like a little container, but I'll take it. Okay, that's really cute. Let's have a look. Oh, so they're bent. Okay. Let's have a look. Okay, interesting. Can you see that? Can you see that? What? That's interesting and cool. Okay. Oh, gosh. We'll see what we can do with that. That could look cool on my stiletto. Once again, not really on nails um oh yeah and if anyone's wondering i didn't get rid of my nails underneath so they're pretty long now <laughs> so i kind of want to make them grow out and then start doing builder because this is like hard gel and i want to start using builder gels and that so that's why they're kind of there i know it's not the prettiest of things but it's the only way you just have to suffer for it to get them the length you want <laughs> so yeah look how cute i'll pop them back we're almost done with the video Okay, let's do the bows next. So, like I said, love bows. So, we've got just a bunch of white. <laughs> white bows. They're stunning. They're literally... I've used them so many times on my channel. I don't really think you guys need to see them again. But we did get, like, 50. So, here they are. Then, they had this little selection. So, we've got some black and white ones. And they're, like, different shapes, different kind of designs of bows. Some of the, the black ones have, like, white and black lines on them. Really cool. And then I've seen these forever and I kind of wanted to see what they look like. So we got these bow looking things with hearts in the middle, which I thought were really cool. Look how cool. So we got those. There's only five. So I guess not a lot for your money, but still really cute. Then I got some, I think they're called Fimos. I think they're called Fimo. F E M O? Fimo? Maybe don't know but they're really cool <laughs> i usually see the fruit ones but they had these little flower ones and like they had such a variety i think so i kind of was drawn to these the most once again these are only really cool if you're gonna build your nails do acrylics and all that so we'll see how it goes maybe you see on the channel maybe not we'll see what the future holds with me and nails and building and all of that good stuff so we'll see but they're really cute so far we'll give them a go next up we have some blue crystals I don't really have a lot of coloured shaped crystals, so when I saw these, I was really excited. So they're like proper, what would you call this, like royal blue, like deep blue in person. They are absolutely stunning. And you just get different shapes. You've got hearts, stars, like a little square, 
I don't know, teardrop alerty looking things. Just a nice little variety that you can mix and match to create a nail crystal design. So often I have colored just circle standard crystals. So it'll be really fun to have actual shapes. Just quickly for the boring stuff, I've got these little sticks with it looks like cotton at the end. So for example, if you, you know, go over the line, go onto the skin, you could probably use these to like clean up and stuff. So I thought these would be really cool to use um, when doing people's nails or your own nails. Next thing for boring, maybe, I don't know, you might actually like brushes i've been using obviously builder like hard gel to do my nails and i think i picked up a brush like to actually like pick up the yeah so i thought give one of these a go because at the moment i'm using my um what is it not good to bounce it's my mo you no not my mo you madam there we go madam girl application brush is what i use it works amazing but i thought let me try some other brushes so we've got this one just really cute i like the little crystals and it's the rainbow which is fun and then last thing for the boring stuff we also got some buffer blocks so we've got some of them too and they're really cute because they're ombre look how cool all right we're coming to the end of the video last two things to show you so you all know i love my ab crystals and when they had a super crazy cheap affordable different shaped ab crystals i of course had to have it so here it is in all its glory so they're kind of cool there's a lot of shapes that i, ha I don't actually have like this weird like droplet thing looking i've got a bow i don't have a bow in ab's that's really cool a cute little butterfly so nice little variety i thought of course always ab's are always a win and lastly for today's video we've got these which once again very unique i love looking at unique nail arts like honestly <laughs> i could buy nail art like all of it i don't even use it i don't use enough to what i buy but i just can't help myself i think like i i feel like i get drawn to nail art more than i even do for gel polishes or any other products so here it is this could look really cool for halloween it's black but it's got this kind of rainbow reflection as light hits i don't know if it's picking it up but it's really really cool i wonder if i can open it Ugh. There we go. Are you able to see the rainbowy reflection to it? And it's really interesting and really cool. So there's different, of course, sizes and shapes. So we've got hearts, we've got like a butterfly. This is just a square. Uh, don't know what that is. A star, a little rectangle, a bow, a triangle, a flower, like a droplet thing, droplet thing, rectangle. So you've got different little things. They're very small though. So probably really good for nails. Or maybe like scattering them across the nail maybe. Who knows. But they're really cool. Very unique. I didn't like haven't seen these kind of things before. So I thought I might give it a go. Once again, everything that I got today definitely shook me by price. Which is probably why I just instantly got into my basket. So I'll have all the prices listed as I was kind of showing you. I'm thinking... If the link isn't active, I might not put the price on the screen as I'm showing that given product. Because if it's not available, then I guess it's kind of a bit of a bummer. And it's, I don't really want to upset you with how much I paid for it. <laughs> and you can't even get it anyways. But I hope you guys liked the, vi liked the video. I love doing hauls. I love buying stuff and showing you guys. So I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I would love to see you all in my next video. Ooh, bye, guys.